When you think about cubing YouTubers who post comedy, the first person that comes to mind is TNL Cubing. From roasting himself in his own videos to posting the funniest skits on YouTube, there is no doubt that TNL Cubing will always bring out a laugh. With all of this, he has finally surpassed 10,000 subscribers or in YouTube terms, a bronze play button. But TNL Cubing's success did not come easily at all. Far from it in fact. TNL uploaded his first video in June 2016 and it was called 3x3 Dayan Zanchi Review. This video was not too well made and it didn't even have a proper thumbnail and this would remain the case for the next 15 or so videos. On August 31st, 2016, TNL Cubing uploaded a video called I Made a New 2x2 Method. This video got way more views than usual and currently stands at 6400 views. From this point on, you could clearly tell that TNL Cubing's thumbnails and content was improving quite a bit. This improvement of quality in thumbnails and videos got TNL his first 100 subscribers in December 2016, six months after he started his channel. After December 2016, TNL sort of slowed down on the upload grind. He was uploading one video every couple of weeks and by September 2017, he had 300 subscribers. He had also started to upload a little bit more frequently and this helped his channel growth quite a bit. However, the biggest change was still yet to come. On 12th of December 2017, TNL Cubing put out a video called Why I Love the Yushin Little Magic. This video still stands as the second most viewed video till date at 62,000 views. This video not only brought about a huge boost in his views, but it also changed the style of his videos for the better. As you can see from this point on, most of his thumbnails followed a pretty similar trend to the Little Magic video. In January 2018, helped by the Little Magic video, TNL Cubing hit 500 subscribers. However, this was the point where TNL Cubing started uploading very very occasionally. He would upload only one or two videos per month and his growth started slowing down. He crossed 1000 subscribers during the month of July in 2018. For around a year after that, there was silence on TNL Cubing's channel. He would continue to upload videos here and there, however, nothing was too serious. On March 12, 2019, TNL Cubing uploaded a video called the Best Rubik's Cube Loop Comparison between Gan, Moyu, Chi and more. This video still stands as his most viewed video at 65,000 views. The months of July and August in 2019 were some of the best months for TNL Cubing's channel. He was able to upload a lot more videos than usual and that pushed his subscriber count quite a bit ahead. On the 21st of July 2019, TNL Cubing flew past 2000 subscribers. After hitting 2000, it seemed like TNL Cubing had gotten back into the video making mood. His video quality improved a ton, his uploads were a lot more frequent and his subscriber count flew up. Aside from taking a couple of breaks in late April and October 2020, TNL Cubing continued to upload throughout quarantine. His funny videos brought out laughter and joy from other cubers during this depressing period. As Tingman's channel was gaining a lot of popularity during this period, Tingman's daughter, Olor, kept giving TNL Cubing personal shoutouts. Here's an example. But don't forget to subscribe to TNL Cubing. TNL Cubing? What? Not again! These little shoutouts here and there really helped TNL Cubing's channel and by July 2020, he had hit 5,000 subscribers. As mentioned earlier, TNL Cubing did take a break in October 2020. However, once he got back, his video quality improved a ton and this was the point where he really started to skyrocket. TNL vs Cubehead possibly had the biggest impact on TNL Cubing's channel. From getting a personal shoutout from Cubehead, TNL Cubing gained 700 subscribers in a span of 3 days. A couple of weeks after TNL vs Cubehead, TNL Cubing also did a collaboration with Tingman. This brought him 300 subscribers in a span of 3 days as well. As more and more people started to discover TNL Cubing, more and more people started subscribing to his channel. On March 15, 2021, this happened. So yeah, nearly 5 years of patience, hard work and determination had finally paid off. TNL Cubing finally hit 10,000 subscribers. To put it simply, patience is a key element of success. It is only a matter of time until you achieve your desired results. TNL Cubing took 5 years to reach this milestone and you might too. However, don't be disheartened, your time will come too. So that's about it for my video on the success of TNL Cubing. Thanks a lot for watching, I hope you enjoyed and goodbye.